Hey, Kurt Storing from Liberty Premium Grooming Company. Today we are going to talk about whether or not beard supplements and vitamins actually work, uh, particularly in making your beard grow faster, thicker, healthier, whatever. Um, so this is something that when you talk about beard products, you think about beard oil. But in this particular case, I think more about snake oil. Um, it just, people are selling beard growth oils or pills um, doesn't seem like they're ser they can possibly be serious, but they are. They're trying to get your money. Um, so one of the problems I have with this is a lot of the time people will claim that biotin, uh, which is in some of these products, is this great miracle formulation that will help you grow uh, a stronger beard. And uh, there's a quote from a, a study that I read that uh, says there's quote very weak evidence that biotin can actually improve hair growth and uh, in the cases where it suggests that it might it looks like that actually is the case on people who have a biotin deficiency so it's basically bringing you up to normal hair growing levels not boosting you uh, plus biotin deficiency is very rare according to the study uh, so that being said the the basis basic principles um, might actually help you and that's basically that most of these things are a multivitamin an overpriced multivitamin with biotin added in many cases um, that in that case if you're not getting you know if you're not eating healthy enough if you don't get uh, you know 100% of your daily nutrition and vitamins all the time taking the multivitamin can certainly uh, help now one of the things we have to remember is that you're never going to get past your um, your genes when it comes to growing a beard that's just, you know, you can grow the beard, you can, your genes have dictated that already, and that's it. You're not going to superpower your way to a two times beard growth, it just doesn't happen. So these products, if they are useful, will only ever get you up to your 100%. So if you're at 80%, you know, you're not exercising, you're not really eating right, now that can affect your hair growth. That's just, you know, it needs vitamins, minerals, proteins, etc. to grow that hair. Um, and if you're not getting those things, then it's not going to grow to its... Uh, full potential. So basically what we can do is we can't uh, get hair growth any faster than it already is, but we can maximize our potential for hair growth. Uh, and taking a multivitamin can be one of those things that can help. So the basic premise, you know, you might need a few more vitamins, sure, but, you know, go for a trusted, um, you know, somewhat cheap or multivitamin that's not jacked up 10 bucks simply because it has biotin and masquerades as this hair growing formula. Um, so, you know, if you want to grow your beard thicker, faster, better, make sure you're covering the basics, uh, get enough sleep, eat well, uh, protein, green fibers, veg, um, you know, work out. And that's probably going to do you a lot better. Keep your face clean, use beard products, beard oil, beard balm, brush it out so you've got a nice firm foundation under which uh, the beard can grow on the skin. And uh, yeah, stick to it, stick to the natural stuff. Don't worry about uh, getting some special fancy uh, beard growing malt vitamins or beard elixir oil that's just uh, to me that's silly it's nonsense um, you know if you have a nice scientific study that says you did you know get double the beard growth or 10% more beard growth 1% more beard growth taking these things over and above your uh, potential for beard growth genetically send it to me I would love to see it if it does exist it would be an amazing thing for men who can't grow beards uh, but otherwise stick to the, the basics natural stuff and uh, don't waste your money elsewhere